What's going on YouTube? I got a big treat for you two today. We have Zoila Frost in the house, three-time world champion. She comes all the way from California. She's spending about 10 days with us over here. We're gonna give you a quick glimpse of some of her conditioning work and some of the training that she's gonna be doing getting ready for a fight either in November or January. Mm -hmm. Uh, tell them a little, a little bit about yourself, so, uh, your background, how many years you've been doing this, so on and so forth. Um, I've been doing it for about 15 years, uh, professionally 12 years, uh, professional Muay Thai and kickboxing about six, MMA has been the longest, it's 15 years. Um, What's your record right now? I don't even remember. 14 and 6. 14 and, and 6. MMA. And yeah, MMA, and 6 and 0 oh in uh, Muay Thai and kickboxing. And your former Bellator, Bellator world champion? Mm -hmm. Former Bellator world champion, IKKC Muay Thai world, and WBC Muay Thai. So, pretty much certified badass in her specialty. Um, she came to me, she wanted to do some conditioning work with me before her fight in November. And so that's what we're getting done. Uh, I've probably never seen anyone with more of a work ethic than Zoila. She fucking kills it every day she's here. So I want to give you guys a quick glimpse of some of the stuff she does and what it takes to be a world champion. So we just finished up some uh, mid work, some bag work, jumping rope, shadow boxing, uh, and now we're gonna do a little bit of conditioning, all right? We're gonna jump on the air dam bike, some rowing, some movement, and some uh, power striking and speed striking, um, just to add on to the end. Because at the end of the day, whoever, is, who has, whoever has the best lungs, you know, uh, your three or four rounds in, that, that's gonna be a key right there. So we usually do, all training days. I do all training days with her. One day we do conditioning in the beginning and then we do all technical work in the afternoon um, or after. And then the other day we'll do technical work and then condition. Why? Well, constantly do conditioning first and then you do technical work after the fighter or your client is going to be tired, fatigued, and they're not going to be thinking the same. All right. Uh, they're going to be a little bit more sloppier. They're not going to be on point. That's why you kind of have to alternate and give one or the other priority every other day. It's the way they like to do it, you know? And not even including like you know, strength work or anything like that. We're just talking about straight conditioning and straight mitt work or pad work for endurance and cardio. So, uh, hope you guys enjoy this little uh, conditioning work. I'm gonna show you all the rounds and everything that we do.
All right, guys, so that pretty much concludes our training for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Guys, I can't say it enough. Go to Zoila Frasso's page. Where, they can, where can they reach you at? I'm on Instagram, Facebook, all those social media outlets. Zoila Frasso, at Zoila Frasso. It's gonna be on the bottom of the page, guys. Follow her journey. She's, I'm telling you, she's gonna be another Bellator champ. She's gonna get another belt from Bellator. It's gonna happen. So guys, definitely tune in to her journey. Go follow her page. As for me, you're here on my page, comment, subscribe, let me know what you thought about the video. If you have any questions for Zoila, go ahead and put them in the comments and she's gonna be scrolling through the comments and she's gonna be answering little by little, okay? Thank you guys, appreciate you, on to the next one.